everyone and welcome to a new video. My name is Larissa and today I decided to do another fan video reaction. Normally I don't do that while a show is airing because I mostly make them when there's no show at the moment I can react to so I actually have some stuff to upload. Um, but because of the episode from last week which was kind of heartbreaking <laughs> then I came across this video about Theon and then I was like okay I really want to watch this and maybe I should make a reaction to it. The thing about Theon is we knew him since the first season and uh, he's been through a lot and that's why I think this video might be really emotional because we're probably going back to season one from the start this is probably uh, like his journey that's what I expect right now uh, so yeah I'm going to do a reaction to that and of course don't forget to subscribe on the person who made it I'll put the channel in the description and then I'm going to start now so let's go the iron island sigil a kraken words we do not sow lords the grey joys famed for their skills at archery navigation and lovemaking and failed rebellions Father. and the grey joy We've been lords of the Iron Islands for 300 years. There's not a family in Westeros that can look down on us. Your master doesn't seem to like Lannisters. He's not my master. Put away your blade. Take orders from your father, not you. Of course not. What about the Starks? The lady's whereabouts. The lady? Not... Your loyalty to your captors is touching. The Starks have made you theirs. My blood is salt and iron. I have no other family. Don't you? I could never be a Stark. Rob Stark always reminded me of that. And it's not your duty. Because it's not your house. I'm a Greyjoy. I can't fight for Rob and my father both. We are ironborn. We're ironborn. We're not subjects. We're not slaves. It's what I was born to be. We take what is ours. You serve me as loyally as you serve Ned Stark. I will be as good to you as he ever was. I'll help you, Theon Greyjoy. Betray me, and you will wish you hadn't. It's all just a game. Well, let's play a game. Now you are truly lost. Which body part do you need the least? <laughs> mercy! This is mercy. I'm not killing you. If you think this has a happy ending, just making a few alterations. <laughs> you haven't been paying attention. Theon was our enemy. But Rick. Do you love me? Rick. Yes, my lord. Yes, of course, my lord. What's your name? Rick. Until when? Rick will never betray us. Always. You betrayed my family! I'm sorry, I'm sorry! <laughs> Help me! What's your name? Rick! My name is Rick! I've always been Rick! You're Theon Greyjoy! Your name is Theon Greyjoy. Run away, little Theon. Run. Are you a woman, boy? It's what you do best. I have her. Come and get her. wanted to do the right thing. Oh my god, this is so the beautiful. Right kind of person, but never knew what that meant. It always seemed like that, like there was an impossible choice I had to make. Make your choice, Theon, and do it quickly. Stark or Greyjoy. My real father lost his head at King's Landing. He never lost him. He made a choice. He's a part of you, just like he's a part of me. And I chose wrong. And now I've burned everything down. You don't need to choose. You're a great joy, and you're a star. I've known you many years, Theon Greyjoy. You're not the man you're pretending to be. I deserved everything. I did terrible things. Rob Stark is dead. I turned on Rob, captured Winterfell. When you take the black, all your crimes are forgiven. I don't want to be forgiven for the things I've done. I can never make amends to your family for the things I've done. Where will you go? It's not my place to forgive you for all of it. Home. <laughs> but what I can forgive, I do. If you're so broken that there's no coming back, take a knife and cut your wrists. But if you're staying, Theon, I need you. The real Theon Greyjoy, not this ratchet pretender. Who are you? Can you find him for me? I am Theon Greyjoy. Stay down, or I'll kill you. Last living son of Balon Greyjoy. She can't lead an attack. And why not? Not for me. Are you with me? You're a woman! And she is your rightful ruler. Fiora! He's my brother. Those of you have sailed under, though. and there are many of you here. He's a Greyjoy. You know what she is. She is a Reaver. She is Ironborn. You're my queen. 
This is our queen. I go where you command. You want to go to Winterfell? To fight for the Starks? I want to fight for Winterfell, Lady Sansa. Go. If you'll have me. My sword is yours. In victory and defeat. I took this castle from you. Let me defend you now. From this day until my last day. I wish the things I did. Everything you did brought you where you are now. If it's what they want, it comes to that, you know I'll stand behind what? you. Is there going to be a battle in the God's Wood? Where you belong. Home. Let Theon, your servant, be born again from the sea as you were. Bless him with salt. Bless him with stone. Bless him with steel. What is dead may never die. What is dead may never die. What is dead may never die. What is dead may never die! Theon. I knew it. I yeah. knew this was coming now. You're a good oh. man. What is dead may never die. Thank you. What is dead may never die. <laughs> the elm. <laughs> this was so beautiful. Oh my god. Just to see his entire journey like this and also things I, I hadn't even thought about like like before everything happened with, with Ramsey and, and before he got captured that he was like um, to Yara like she can't lead the attack because she's a woman and uh, I'm your last living son and when he returned he was of course such a different person but when he came back to the Iron Islands uh, that he was supporting Yara and doing it all for Yara because she was their queen because he wanted Yara to be their leader and I like how it's not just in like a chronological order but that it's just like you see different times at different uh, places and then like for example in the end when when Bran said to you and you're a good man I just knew this had to be in the video so I thought that that part came at that moment and then Bran was like Theon and then well, there was a different part of little Bran saying Theon and it's just such a small thing, but it like broke my heart. I just think that Theon is such a beautiful character, actually. He's been through so much and he's always been on this like mission to actually find out who he really is. Because like we all know, he's a Greyjoy, but he grew up with the Starks and for him it's really hard to... Like he's both, but he's also none of them. Because when he returned to the Greyjoys, they were like, oh, but your other family... And when he was with the Starks, like he also said, Rob always reminded him that he wasn't a Stark and he always kept reminded of that, that he wasn't really a Stark, that he was just living with them. And I think that's just a, a really hard thing to go through. I mean, he grew up like that and I don't think he ever, the thing is he died really young and I, never, and I don't think that he ever really got to find out where he really belongs. I just don't think he ever felt in place. Only at the, the last moment before his death, defending Bran, doing the right thing, and he just died a hero, but his entire life he just didn't know where he belonged or what he was doing, what he had to do, and, and that's why Theon is just such... I think he's a very emotional character to, I mean, to look at, to, to watch his story. It's just a very emotional story, actually, if you think about it. And also, like we saw, a lot of people think Theon as a coward. And of course, he did things that made him a coward, like... Uh, attacking Winterfell and taking it over while, while all the men were gone or uh, just he always runs away but in the end when when he was tortured by Ramsay he he just had a trauma he had PTSD so that was very logical but of course people are not gonna say oh no that's fine then, then you don't have to fight then you can just run away so he was just always thought of as a coward and in the end he just proved himself and he did the right thing and I think that's so beautiful. Besides Theo, this was just a really well edited and beautiful video and I think it perfectly put Theon's storyline in in like five minutes. It's just you see all the seasons, you see all the things he went through, all the things he did and yeah I don't know how many times I've said beautiful but it's really beautiful and I really like the video and I'm not sure whether I'm going to do more uh, fan video reactions. I just saw this one and I really I just really wanted to react to it. I don't know why I just felt like, I mean, Theon just died and it can be quite emotional. 
it was like you saw so that's why i reacted to it maybe i'll do it some other time if i see a good video and i still have this whole playlist from last year which i all wanted to react to i'm not sure if i'm still going to do that but maybe when there are no other shows to react to anymore then i will uh continue to react on uh fan videos so uh, did you like this please leave a like subscribe let me know what you thought of this and then i really hope to see you monday at my game of thrones reaction <laughs> bye Oh, <laughs>